We're here inside QAC TV studios and we're talking about healthcare today because it's always great to hear about more options. And with more options, we need more doctors. So we're going to meet a new doctor today. Introducing Dr. Lamphere. Good morning. Good morning. So Maryland Primary Care Physicians, which Dr. Walsh and Dr. Lamphere work at, has been open for 30 years now, right? It will be our 30th anniversary on April of next year. It's very exciting. So a lot of people in the area probably already know you. I think they do, yeah. <laughs> yeah right. But now it's time to meet Dr. Lamphere. Right. So welcome to the area. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, so how long have you been here now? So I've been here since the end of August, okay. um, right here in Queenstown and uh, you know, doing really well, ramped up pretty quickly. There was definitely, oh, yeah. uh, wasn't so much that was taken over for anybody, it was just that, that increased need that we had here. So I've right. uh, been ramping up pretty quick and, and off and running now. So. Great, great. So how long have you been practicing? Uh, so I was in practice for three years before this uh, in Connecticut, where I'm from originally, uh, before making the switch uh, moving down here. So, right. um, so yeah, this is three and change years. So. That's awesome. I hear you brought some people along with you. I did, yeah. My wife's uh, and her family are originally from down here in Maryland. It's where we uh, had met when I was an, an undergrad in, in Hopkins. And so we, I dragged her up to New England for a while, and then we made our way back down here with our 18-month-old uh, daughter. So That's very now we get a little closer to the, the in-laws there. Yeah, so a little close enough for help. But exactly. Still close enough that well, maybe you can just give a little bit. A little buffer zone, <laughs> yeah, sure, exactly. You need a buffer zone with family. For sure. Great, great. So what made you choose this area? Um, so I was familiar with it, like I say, having gone to, to undergrad in Baltimore and then down in D.C. for med school uh, at George Washington. So uh, I'd been here for almost a decade in the past. And uh, again, just kind of getting, making our way south a little bit so that we could get uh, my daughter a little closer to her in-laws. And, right. uh, and, you know, I mean, Maryland is, uh, you know, so very good experience living here in the past. And, uh, uh, you know, wanted to get a little closer to the water and, and a little bit more of that uh, shore life. So. Right. And, and of course, it was because of Dr. Walsh. And absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> well, I wouldn't have come here if it wasn't a good group for me to join up with. So, uh, so that was made it an easier decision for sure. That's we great. did a little bit of convincing. Yeah. yeah. It's totally well, you know, that that dance, a little back and forth yeah. beforehand. So. And he's doing what I think is ideal. He's doing the live, work, and play thing. He's <laughs> he's living right here on um, on Eastern Shore, only mm -hmm. a mile or so from our office. Mm -hmm. And working and eventually playing, I guess. <laughs> right, right, right. Yeah. yeah, it's the shortest commute I've had, so it definitely makes a big difference. That's so. great. Yeah, the short commute, man. That, that's the joy of life. Absolutely. Is that short commute? Yeah. Yeah. So you, I was introduced to you guys today. I'm not. A lot of people know I'm not from the area, mm -hmm. but you guys are located right near the emergency service building. Mm -hmm. Correct. You're right. Our office is right at the uh, Nesbitt Road exit mm -hmm. on Route 50, mm -hmm. um, where that emergency center is. There's a um, medical office building right next to it, adjacent to it, and we take up half the first floor of that right. building. Uh, there's actually 10 providers there. Mm -hmm. There's uh, not just me and Dr. Lamphere, but, <laughs> I mean, but there's uh, six physicians and four nurse practitioners that work in our office. Mm -hmm. And so it's a pretty busy place. Yeah, mm -hmm. and you're so busy that you actually have some nice extended hours too, right? Yep, absolutely. So we're there seven in the morning, five days a week, Monday through Friday, uh, and then we're there in the evenings, Monday through Thursday, till eight o'clock. Uh, and we also do Saturday mornings for uh, acute care kind of visits. So um, trying to make sure we can help to keep our patients at their home base instead of sending them to urgent care or the, right. the emergency room. Yeah, it's great. Yeah, there's a lot of talk these days about um, transitional care and p people going to see specialists, go in the hospitals, and sometimes there's a little bit of discontinuity, mm. but we're trying to stay open as much as we can so the continuity all stays in one place and right. we don't have to chase specialists around to get reports and, you know, and things like that. And we know what's going on with our patients because we are available to see them. Right. And then that's an amazing little, uh, little bit of help that you have there that there's all types of options, people you can refer all of your patients to. Right. I yeah. mean, you know, back when I first started, um, the Eastern Shore was pretty bleak in terms of specialists. Mm -hmm. You know, Easton always had the hospital there and the specialists, but this area between Annapolis and Easton was kind of like no man's land. Right. But over the last 30 years, that's changed a lot, and uh, we have a lot of specialists. In fact, in our own building, we have um, a specialist in urology, orthopedics, physical therapy, cardiology. We have a um, full... Um, Radiology office right across this right across the hall from us, so people can be in the same building and go get their X-rays. Right. Uh, our lab, we have a lab that's in and part of our own company in our office, um, where we draw blood and send it out to be processed. But um, the stuff that we can't do goes out to a reference lab, you know, like LabCorp mm -hmm. or Quest or right. one of those labs. Mm -hmm. That's great, mm -hmm. and it's it's also very important to notice that we're, we're talking to you guys and we're hearing all these great options and what makes you guys so special that you are welcoming new patients. 
We still are, yep. Yeah. We have to make sure Dr. Lanford's schedule gets filled. <laughs> yeah, that's right, you're gonna, you're gonna learn Gotta everyone's name on Ken Island by the time we're done <laughs> right. here. Gotta keep busy, so. <laughs> and if he doesn't meet him in the office, he'll see him at Safeway or he'll right. see him at there Kmart or yeah. somewhere else, it's fun. Yeah, you, you'll be diagnosing people all the time, Absolutely. every every weekend. <laughs> <laughs> I imagine that's probably already happened. Oh yeah, I think yeah. it's sometimes when you're, it's the change in attire that sometimes lets you stay under the radar with people. Right. But. <laughs> yeah, right after we get done here, I'm going to expect a full physical, you're going to take care of me. I'll have yeah. to put on my disguise to go back out. And <laughs> yeah, you know, there, I hear doctors talking about pros and cons about living in the community where mm -hmm. you work. I've lived in this community for 20 years and worked here for 30 years, and I really like it. You know, I, right. get, to, I get to see the people that I see in the office out at events, community events, and like I said, shopping and whatnot. Right. It's nice to be part of the community. Right. Yeah, that's really cool. So you think you'll stick around? Yeah, I think so. I mean, again, it's been a, a great start here and, and you know, super welcoming the community. You know, I think uh, we've, we've been uh, very, very happy as far as the, the transition. It was nice and smooth. So. Yeah, it's great. So we've been around for 30 years and we expect to see you when we've been around for 60. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'll, I'll keep coming back until then. Yeah, eventually so. we'll just switch chairs and there'll be another <laughs> young guy sitting next right, to you. Right, yeah, yeah. There you yeah, go. I'll we'll just slide on down. Yeah, right. again. yeah, my daughter will be in here interviewing. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> That's great. Well, it was very nice meeting you. Definitely. Welcome to Community. Thank so you. So great to have it. you, Dr. Walsh. It was oh, yeah. great seeing nice you. Nice to see you. Yeah. So, if you guys want some help and you want a new doctor or you need someone to, to visit, Maryland Primary Care Physicians are there for you. And welcome, Dr. Lamphere, to the community. Come in, say hello. <laughs> Thanks. Thank you so much. Oh, yeah.